How you doing, people? I just uh, installed the new front stay JBL 50 inch woofers with a horn, and uh, and I'm just connected with uh, each woofers with the individual amplifier. Well, actually, I run one amplifier to uh, run. Uh, two speakers and one for the center speakers which mean I'm using uh, a thousand watts per channel on each of the front stage speakers and um, the vocal is very very loud and gosh when I say loudest mean you have more output and I can see the clarity with the horn versus speakers on center channel it will make a lot of experience complete difference in the way i see so far i just start testing these uh, three uh, uh speakers that I put on the front to see how it was different between the one i used before which is a bmw but was a single driver with a tweeter and it sound clear nice but not that loud Okay, this one's a little more output. Uh, you can adjust a little bit with the amplification and so far, but it's coming very good. And I just go ahead and gonna do a little dim, dim uh, but I should see how they sound more likely. Uh, more likely for this kind of communication probably don't sound the same as you hear in person. But I just go ahead and gonna go to a little bit what I did and I'm going to show you that at uh, another 2000 wattish amplifiers to accommodate all the speakers on front and the side and so far. So uh show you that in, 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 short, in just a minute. I just go ahead and go and put a little demo and see how these as particular uh, equipment and speakers will help this sound system a little bit better. Now, I hope it come out in a way I'm expecting as far as sound and quality and clearness. And that is important to me. All right, guys. Let me go ahead and start put this one up and see how the sound. And uh, you tell me a little bit what your opinion is. Maybe give me some comments as well. Uh, it would be helpful for, for me on this journey of the home theater. Let's go ahead and put that and see how the sound. this planet's great warrior. You have such a beautiful world. Filled with an abundance of life. Savory. My master grows hungry. Give me the transwarp key and he will spare your home. We'd rather die than let him reach other planets. So be it. Oh well, it will sound very, very awesome. It sounds very, very awesome. I really enjoy it. And the way they sound and right now let me put the little light a little bit on a little bit so you can uh, be able to see what i did uh additional in this system all right i'm going to go to the rack where i have uh my uh all the uh, woofers uh, amplification i got some amplification over here which can control the surround system all right and and the back uh woofers and so far but this is the one I used at uh, this time. Let me bring it down a little bit, see if you guys can see. So what I did right here, on this session right here, I added these uh, uh, Chrome 2000, okay? And I added these uh, uh, QSC amplifier. Uh, I had those amplifier for a while, 
okay, I used to be a DJ, and those uh, generate each one about uh, 2,000 wattage, somewhere around there, all right? And I had this Chrome, which is about 1,500 watt. So these are the system that I'm using to run uh, part of the front stage, and of course, I got some amplification to run into left and right side uh, woofers on front. So pretty much that is what I use at this point. Uh, you don't see the light is because I put like a little tape because when I'm watching a movie, the little flash yellow and green appear when the woofer turn on, uh, uh, especially in some volume. So that's the reason I put the little tape so you don't see no uh, uh, light is because I cover it up, all right? just for the purpose when I'm watching a movie not to get uh, uh, distracted by by the light. And that's pretty much that's what I use here to uh, come in at the front stage. So it's coming it's coming very good and very well on this system. I think I like it, I enjoy it. And uh, I'm gonna continue test it a little bit more and see how it's doing the performing, all right? Because I can see uh, with the horn, the clarity of the vocal, it will increase uh, a lot, uh, a little more. So now when I'm playing uh, on my volume, I can realize that uh, I don't need to put the volume uh, uh, high because those speakers are very, very sensitive as far as uh, they not require a lot of power. So uh, it's, it's, it's setting right now, it's about 98 to 99 dB. So pretty much it's very sensitive for speakers. So uh, in reality, I don't really need a lot of power, but basically I got those amplifiers and those amplifiers is, is 2000 wattage. I use it just to see how they sound and how to do. And I just did what I did is bring the power, the power down and, and the level that I don't have to, uh, uh, but actually they don't get distortion. So I just put it lower, all right? And then after that, I control that one with the, with the remote control on the volume section. Because in reality, uh, in this room, uh, now the, the questions of speakers and woofer change tremendously. Uh, and this point, I'm running, and instead of being nine, now I'm running 11 speakers 11 speaker, it would be 1149, 1149, that's what I have in this 15 by 15 system. So actually, uh, I don't need to bring the value very, very loud because those many speakers in the small area and and, the, uh, actually, and also the woofer, the compressor, it will be faster because it's not a big room, all right? The according with this is about 15 by 15, 15.3, pretty much like that. So, uh, it start coming pretty good. I continue testing a little bit more of the speaker so I can give you feedback. It's an old model, uh, I believe I got the JBL uh, M Pro. Okay, it's a 15 inch woofer with the horn. All right, so actually, it, it's, it's coming very, very good. I will test that out. Uh, a little more and see what happened during time if uh, uh, continue with the same speaker or I just go ahead and put back in my BMW like it was in the front but at this point I start getting very fascinated with the performance that is doing the front stage and this is an important part the front stage is the more important part so let's see continue what it we be doing so far I, I like it in the way it's right now, but we see in time because I don't want to be fatigated with with the sound too loud or, or anything like that. I want everything level on the same for the same level. All the speakers and the front stage, everything on the same level. That's what I'm looking for. So I'm going to do my testing there. Maybe I'm going to go and put the calibration thing so I can calibrate it, uh, 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 the front stage, the side, and the woofers. I'm gonna calibrate all of, uh, all over again, a couple of times in, in different areas, different sections, I will put the mic and see if I can get the Ultima sound in this home theater. So anyway, guys, this is uh, this is a short video what I did at this point, and I hope you guys enjoy what uh, the next step and the next level that I'm trying to do 
in this home theater and i think it's coming pretty well it's coming very good and uh and 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 i'll be fascinated i really like it i really enjoy it so this is very good this is a test that i'm doing it and i think it's working pretty good i'll see you guys later and have a nice day bye bye